it's monday get ready with us we had a great weekend and i hope that you guys did too still cleaning up some of the fun some of the ruckus uh that we caused before the weekend which that's always a good time i have videos on my playlist titled new here some of the last few i think that where i talk about the things um that anthony and i mainly myself uh do to rebuild trust and again i just want to say what happened between anthony and i happened 15 years ago when i was 19 and i find it very funny that the majority of the people that are judging me you can't even fit in the jeans that you wore 15 years ago or when you were 19 but y'all want to act like i'm the same person i'm not baby i'm not anthony's not perfect i'm not perfect um and people are like oh my god your kids are gonna see this and i mean are we i'm sorry did we take a consensus to just pretend to our children that we're perfect and we are above mistakes Not even mistakes but are we going to pretend to our children like there aren't times where we know better and we still don't do better i mean if your kids are anything like mine your kids do that every day and showing a kid that you can come back from that and that is not the final thing that doesn't define who you are i mean that lesson's invaluable definitely not proud of what i did but i do not walk around in shame i'm proud of the fact that i have a god that offers me forgiveness that forgets it and i know that you are people you are not god so god says that he forgets it he doesn't remember it people still remember that but the person that i am most concerned about has forgiven me and while he doesn't just forget it and put it out of his mind i work on a daily basis to rebuild trust and i think we do pretty well in that area we might argue over how we're spending our time or whether or not our 13 year old should have a credit card but one of the things that we have not argued about is issues surrounding trust because of the things that i do anthony has not asked me to do any of those things anthony honestly hasn't asked me to do anything i do them and like i said i've shared them in uh previous videos so i won't go through every single one of them now but i do a lot more than most people if you are the one that cheated i don't think that the other person should ever be in a position where they have to ask you to do anything um if you are having to ask someone to do something to make them trust you after a situation of infidelity run because they're not ready and that's because it's just that important to me it's important that he feels comfortable it's important that he feels safe and i know it's not something that happens overnight but that's something that we build over time i feel like we have more trust in our relationship bless you oh no now than we've ever had before so and it won't work for everybody are you pooping on me yeah you are